Okay, so this is the sort of the second step in our digestible bites, these little videos. And what we're going to do now is the first thing you really need to do after you've kind of established that you know this app is you need to import your product shots. Um, I will answer right off the bat that yes, there is a way to do bulk uploads in a CSV file. You cannot do that and also bring in photos at the same time. Um, it's pretty difficult to do. This is not an easy thing to do. So I figured what we would do today is just to do it um, pretty much one at a time so you, so you see really how this app works um, and uh, rather than just go, you know, going straight to CSV files. So as I mentioned up here, we go to the inventory button and you'll be able to see here that you want to, um, across this bar, and I'll move my finger there, there's an add new item add new category, action, and send to email. What we're going to do right now is we're going to add a new item. So why don't we call this the, uh, I don't know, Colchester Sofa. And it is a, I don't know, let's say a blended leather sofa, for example. Blended leather. And the SKU is one, two, three, four, five, six. We enter the SKU. The description, again, is blended leather oopsie leather sofa alright uh, the item type this is not a service it's an inventory item and uh, the price what we would like to call that $5.99 cost $4.80 does that sound about right? sure Four, we'll go with that just for this example $4.80 just for this example MSRP what do you think Seb? MSRP oh $8.99 $8.99 we like that alright so tax, quantity on hand, you can pop all of that in there yourself. Now we've done some categories that we've done ahead of time. I have the sofa category. You can pop it into the sofa category. And when you're done making this product inventory um, item, you want to click done. You want to push that blue done button and then you can see over here all the items. Now I've popped in a couple of these prior but you can see that we um, did the Colchester sofa. So um, should I do one more of those Sev or do we have enough time we or is one not. or not? We don't have enough time this time. Alright, so that is how you do the importing of data. You want to go up to a new item, right? Uh, you can type in whatever when your you know whatever your description is the item ID and then the SKU number and then you want to hit uh, hit this done button and then over here it will populate in your here we go in um, all of your items uh, you can put in categories if you want to put a new category in there uh, let's just say chairs chairs and there you go. Okay, so in a very sort of basic way, that is how you will import your product shots. We'll be right back with how to make an invoice.